Distro TV is a free online streaming service that has recently expanded, adding 120 new live TV channels to their existing lineup. This growth gives viewers even more choice in their news, entertainment, sports, lifestyle categories, as well as adding to their multicultural content. With this ramp up of their offerings, is Distro TV a worthy addition to your app library? Let's go and find out. If you're looking for a new VPN service, why don't you check out the links in the description below this video. Clicking on these links can not only give you a great discount off of your next VPN subscription, but clicking through these links also helps to support my channel. First, just a quick overview of what DistroTV is if you haven't heard of it yet. DistroTV is a free streaming service launched in 2019, initially with over 100 free channels to watch live shows, movies, sports, news and gossip anytime and anywhere, always for free. What's more, DistroTV doesn't require a subscription and no sign-up is required. As far as I'm aware, DistroTV is available worldwide. Drop me a comment down below to let me know where you are and if you can get DistroTV in your area. However, content does vary depending on your location. I'm using NordVPN connected to a US server to change my location in order to view more content. You can find links to NordVPN in the description down below. In June this year, DistroTV announced a massive 120 new channels, taking its total channel library to more than 270. Now this puts Distro TV above the likes of Pluto and Zumo in the quantity of free live TV channels offered. If you want to take a look for yourself, you can download the Distro TV app on your Fire TV from the Amazon App Store, on Android from the Google Play Store, on iOS and Apple TV, and as a channel on your Roku. You can also watch online on any web browser, wherever you are, by going to www.distro.tv. In this video, I'm using the Distro TV app on my Fire TV Stick 4K Max that I've installed from the Amazon App Store. Now, unfortunately, the app doesn't have the best layout in my opinion. When you load it up, a live channel starts playing in the background while you scroll through the channel thumbnails over the top, which does seem a little messy. You can scroll across the screen to view the live TV categories, which are new arrivals, news and opinion, channels in Spanish, business, movies, Indian and South Asian, classic shows and movies, US local TV, more movies, reality TV, entertainment, fun and games, live sports, MMA and more, outdoors, travel and lifestyle, documentaries, African, music, mood and radio. There should be something for every taste and interest. For sports fans, the number of sports channels has doubled to 45 to include the most diverse collection of live mainstream sports, combat sports, outdoor sports and niche sports, with channels such as BN Sports Extra, Impact Wrestling, Swerve Sports, The Rugby Network, Fight Network, ACL Cornhole, Fuel TV, Moto America TV, Sports Grid, Boxing TV, Fight 24-7 and more. If it's documentaries that you enjoy, 13 new channels have been added including True History, 
Beautiful Planet and Magellan TV. A whole new category has been added that brings entertainment and music channels together in an African channel bundle. And 21 Spanish language channels have also been added, such as Canela TV, Astrea Games, Casa Comedy, Spanglish, and Two Cine. And finally, adding to their growing multicultural content, are 21 new channels for Indian content that includes ABP, Food Food, Bollywood Prime. Desai TV, Epic and more. Now if you want a better way at looking at the channel lineup, you can access an EPG or programming guide where you can see what's on now and next. However, there are no search or filter options to view the guide for a specific category only. DistroTV certainly is making an impact with its channel growth and diversity. It's definitely going to appeal to a multicultural demographic and you'll find channels on DistroTV that you won't find anywhere else. However, in my opinion, the app needs more improvement to make it a bit more user-friendly. Let me know your thoughts on DistroTV in the comments section down below. As always, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button, comment and subscribe to my channel, making sure that you turn on notifications so you don't miss out on any of my latest releases. These small actions from you make a big difference to me and helps to improve how YouTube recommends my videos to potential subscribers. And I truly appreciate your help in making my channel grow.